years ago, it would take a few. And uh, the book writing came, as you can see, at the later part of my life, because this is my first book. First book, right. Yes, it was a challenge for my daughter, because it's something I've always wanted to do. And uh, after a year of beating my head against the keyboard, I finally came out with something that was supposed to be. And uh, I took the book through the publishing with a publisher, thank thank the Lord, because trying to do anything like that on your own would be uh, an outrageous situation as far as I'm concerned. It takes so much more to produce this book than I ever thought it would when I first started typing in the beginning. Uh, it was, the ending kept getting further and further away. So, yeah, it was quite an experience. So, how long ha have you been working on this book? I started, it, uh, what, this was, it took two years to publish it, and it's been another year, so it's been a three year project. So. When, uh, when did the idea first come to you? For, the for idea that's in this book? Um, probably 15 years ago. Really? Yeah, I was watching, I think it was a Star Trek episode. And things started to just go off in my head about something they said trips up to you. And then I started to think about artificial intelligence and where it was going to go eventually. And uh, that's what the book is about. It's about how you take uh, simple robotics and then you continue and continue to a point where, where you have a humanoid figure with its own intelligence. We never even thought about how we got We just did it. Like we do everything in this world. We don't think about any consequences. And then when the consequences started coming into life, this young lady who is named after my daughter, Abby, got uh, an idea in her head that she might be able to help, help the AI. And uh, when she does, the whole world starts crashing and crashing. It's about, it's about uh, morality. The book's about morality and about irony in the end. So, and it's one in a series of three. So hopefully the I was going to ask you, when is book two and book three coming out? Book two should be out in, uh, by the end of the year. I hope to have it finished. And because now I know how the publishing goes, it won't take so long. So hopefully within 12 months from today, it will be out. So, did you have kind of a cliffhanger at the end? Oh, so, oh, all right. So that forces that forces you to c keep writing, yes. doesn't it? One person who wrote a review wrote, uh, "Oh, <laughs> after the ending's great." And most people, the ending of the book, they all go, "We can't wait for the second." And it lights a fire under you too. Yes. To, yes. To get it done. Oh, well, the, the problem is, is being an author is almost a full time job. If you actually want to be successful and, you, and give your customers something more, mm -hmm. whereas I did it as a hobby, it's it's sort of combating my real job, which pays the bill. Yeah. At the end of the day, I'm not going to pay the bills for my book unless something really crazy happens. Yeah, uh, that's a hard that's a hard lesson for people who are trying to get their books published is that they think that they're writing something and it's going to be the next J.K. Rowling, and then reality hits them and they're like, oh, you know, I still have to work my full time job. Yeah. To, to and pay especially after they've invested so much time, money, energy, Heart, and, and their imagination. Soul. Yes. Their soul. Yes. Yeah, and and they feel like you know you can feel a little. Um, betrayed in a way because the people you, you give the book to are, are so infused with the fact that you met somebody that wrote a book and you know somebody that wrote a book and they'll promise you anything to get a copy of your book and all they ask is for a review yes. and you don't get that yeah. so this is what this is about this is our first conference mm -hmm. first convention didn't know what to expect, and we're, we're quite happy with the result. That's wonderful. So, hopefully, it will continue. Thank you very much. Are you ready?